Chipmaker MicroSemi's announcement this week that it will buy Vitesse Semiconductor is expected to be an early step in the consolidation process in the industry. The acquisition follows MicroSemi's purchase of Ireland's Mangoa last year and Symmetricom in 2013. Now the spotlight is on Atmel and Silicon Laboratories, two chipmakers that the deal reporter Jaywon Kang says are expected to be potential M&A targets in the industry. Atmel, for example, is a company that has really positioned themselves well in the semiconductor space. They've been getting rid of units that uh, weren't really giving them the margins that they needed. Um, and they also have a management team that's not entrenched. And um, that could you know, sort of mean that uh, they could be open to some M&A. Um, Silicon Laboratories is an example of a company that's big but not uh, quite big enough. And um, they've actually been pretty acquisitive themselves, but a potential buyer could you know, look at those deals and sort of look to harvest them. Regardless of whether Atmel and Silicon Labs agree to a merger or buyout, consolidation in the space is only expected to pick up. So in the past, um, a lot of the players just wanted to stay independent, um, but over the last couple of years, it's been getting um, you know, more difficult and challenging for uh, players in this space to grow revenue and gain scale. And uh, you know, pursuing acquisitions is actually one of the best and easiest ways for these guys to do so. Um, and as the industry matures um, and you know, scale becomes more important, we can expect to see more M&A. In New York, I'm Brittany Umar for The Street.